Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is the Dynamic Sean's View Entertainment right here on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe with an explosive backstage update as concerns the Viper, Randy Orton. Now, there's been a lot of criticism, a lot of hate. There's been a lot of opinions about Randy Orton's character, where he's going, how he hasn't been positioned as good as people remember. Well, as of the latest creative meetings... WWE is looking to enhance and revamp Randy Orton's character. Current rumors circulating is that WWE is going to allow Orton more freedom on the mic and to be himself overall. There was also some talk of WWE tossing in the legend killer antics with his vicious viper side that we saw in 2009. Either way, expect some changes to go down for Orton in the near future. Furthermore, WWE has already started hinting at the old Orton coming out uh, on Raw backstage in a face-off with Ric Flair last week. Orton has voiced frustration with his current heel role and feels it needs to be turned up. And, you know, I, I, I could kind of agree with that because I remember when Randy Orton, before he turned heel last year at SummerSlam, uh, you know, cashing in on Daniel Bryan, everyone was talking about, oh, you know, so generic, he was getting bo boring, he was getting dull, time for him to be... You know, a heel. Time for him to uh, resurge and do a bad guy again. And then he did. And it's kind of been a mediocre run for Randy Orton as a heel, as a top bad guy. But you see, Randy Orton is so genetically gifted in that ring. He is what a wrestler should look like. If you're going to build up the perfect wrestler from the ground up, it would resemble that of Randy Orton. His athletic prowess, the way he tells a story, his knack. But you know what? The WWE has limited Randy Orton. They have backed him into a corner. They have... Really, you know, just warded him down from his mic skills to his in-ring prowess, to what, to the way he looks, to the way he presents himself. But this is an encouraging update, an encouraging rumor of sorts. And you know what? What better, Randy Orton, than to show shades of not only his Viper gimmick, but the Legend Killer. Remember, I re remember backstage at Raw, you know, Randy Orton said, "Oh, you know, should I remind you of why they called me the Legend Killer?" And could that be a thriller for Randy Orton to go back to that place in his career? I definitely think that would be a great idea because you got to wonder that Randy Orton has won it all. He has done it all. He has won a Royal Rumble. He's main evented and headlined at WrestleMania. He has won Mind in the Bank. You know, Randy Orton is only there right now because he loves the business. You know, he loves the passion. He, You know, he the adrenaline is there. Obviously, the love for the business, is it's, it's in his blood. It's in his family. It's in his genes. That's why Randy Orton is still out there performing. But you know what? I think Randy Orton at SummerSlam had a stellar performance. I think Randy Orton outperformed Roman Reigns. I think Randy Orton made Roman Reigns look a lot better than what, what he is uh, capable of. That's why I was actually hoping that Randy Orton was going to win the match at SummerSlam. And by all, by all matters, he probably should have won that match at SummerSlam. Because Randy Orton knows that Roman Reigns is still green. He's still in development. He still has a lot to learn. Randy Orton knows all the tricks of the trade. But I, if I was in Randy Orton's spot right now, the way I was being booked, the way I was being positioned, I'd be like this. Well, you know what? I'm aggravated. I'm agitated. I know I can be better than this. I know I can perform at a higher level. I know that... This whole system isn't working for me right now, and it isn't. But people are still, you know, they're still, you know, levitating towards Randy Orton. They're still giving him a reaction. They're still paying attention. You know, you know, we've seen kind of the Viper strike at, uh, on Roman Reigns just a week before SummerSlam. So, I mean, you know, Randy Orton still has what it takes. He's not killed by any means. Randy Orton can still come back and... Um, you know, have that resurgence and go back to that place in his career and make you forget about his boring, dull run. Your comments and your opinions and what version of Randy Orton do you want to see come out in the WWE? Subscribe.